So we're up for the second start and uh, the one minute gun has just gone and got to love it. Uh, he knows the value of this boat in start and his approach to that start, he came right back across the lot of them to let them all shape up and uh, try and, he'll try and find a slot somewhere in that fleet in front of him. So it's all on again, Marcus Ashley Jones has got the Ashco right on the back of the uh, committee boat. Slams back up there with a bit of a slot but it's all going to get pretty nasty here in a minute as they compress on this start line. Uh, Evan Walker's, oh sorry, that's uh, Pure Blonde, Jimmy, uh, Jimmy Francis coming in there. Got to love it, starting to wind up now. He's got to uh, get up on this boat. He's, he's coming straight up to the stern of uh, Asco, who's dead in the water. So Sevy's going to wait. He knows that if he, he doesn't matter if he's, uh, uh, he doesn't want to be early, he just wants to be on the boat. And there goes the lured uh, fleet, Panasonic, hurtling away. Uh, the kitchen maker had to bail out, nowhere to go. Jimmy Francis. Now, where's Sevy go? He's, oh, he's buggered it. He's slammed into the back of the committee boat. So all that planning has uh, let my... Boy, oh boy, he's stuck in there, uh, Simon. He's still on Gotta Love It. They've got a problem. They've got their bow prodder underneath the marlin board on the ripple side. So <laughs> I was just saying how well Sevy was lining this up, but he just got squeezed out and he stuck the prodder into the back of the starter's boat. And the fleet is gone. So the, be the best boat out of that was Grant Rollison. He got his lane and he's uh, he's just screwing up there nicely. Turn around, Simon. You can see the sign of slam. So did Trevor Barnabas on the smeg. He's got a nice lane. But you can see how these boats are lifting right up into this easterly pressure. You had to be on the committee boat. Seven's still tangled up back here. We'll go back and have a look at what they're trying to do. But it looks a bit ugly. And they don't want to break that pole. I'm just wondering whether they've gone through the back of the boat. Yeah, it looks like it's actually punctured the back of the uh, starter's boat. <laughs> and the pole, you can see them pulling the pole back out. So that's a that's a major. Uh, poor old ripple side. But it doesn't appear to have broken the pole. Uh, yeah, it's taken the block off the end of the pole, so they won't be able to set a shoot today. So they're out of business, folks. There's the uh, favourite for, for today's race. And uh, a big <laughs> pick the podium had... A lot have got to love it in it, and they're out of business. They're breaking their whisker stays. Bad luck, Sebby and the guys. Back to the back to the park they go. So anyway, the race goes on, and we'll get up there with the leaders and uh, just see how Slam's going. But he's looking good from here. Come back to you shortly.